Hey, it's Matt from McGee Farms. It's the end of the year. Christmas Eve day 2023. What a year it's been. Hasn't been a bad year for us, but uh, we've gotten a lot of different projects and products on the farm. A lot of, uh, a lot of products. Uh, some companies started noticing the channel and sent us some stuff and uh, done some reviews on the products, but you know, now we're six months, eight months of uh, having them, um, some even longer than that. And was just wanting, wanting to kind of give some uh, updates, kind of how they've held up, uh, especially ones that were completely worthless that I would say stay away from. And the ones that really surprised me and uh, were great. And on that line of thought, I want to talk about this Saker Mini Chainsaw. This was sent to me by the Saker company, and I'm going to put a link at the uh, in the comments section of this video. This is amazing. I mean, this, when uh, they reached out to me, hey, a mini chainsaw would be nice. I figured this, I'd never heard of the company. It said made in China somewhere, maybe, well, no. Maybe it's not. No, it says chainsaw. I just, uh, I can't read. Uh, don't know where it's made, but Saker, I'd never heard of the company. I figured, you know, yeah, it'd be nice to have, you know, I can always use another chainsaw around. And uh, I really didn't think it was gonna amount to a whole lot. And I was wrong. I have used this a lot. I've used this probably, uh, well, more than my, my regular chainsaw, I will say that. I, uh, it's small, it's compact, I can take it with me easy. And uh, so I usually throw it on the tractor or I'll throw it in the uh, bed of the UTV when I'm gonna be out working. This thing cuts a lot and it cuts bigger stuff than I thought it would. I've not had to sharpen this chain. I've used it really heavy all year. I haven't had to sharpen it. I've had to tighten it, tighten the chain maybe twice. Uh, but, you know, even even less less than that. I mean, uh, I think I've only, as much as I've used it, I've rarely had to change the battery. This battery lasts forever on it. And, you know, again, I'd never heard of this company, so I figured three months this battery will be junk. I have to buy another battery. No, this battery's lasted, and it lasts forever on a charge. They've sent me a couple other products and they've been just, just as good. And uh, I can't say enough about this product. It's, uh, it's cheaper. I usually buy Ryobi tools. Quality wise, I would put this up with the Ryobi as far as quality. Cause I mean, this holds up. I have a Ryobi uh, 10 inch electric chainsaw that I use as well. And I use the two of them probably more than my regular one, just cause it's easier than dealing with gas, but but this thing, if you're uh, you know looking at tools, I guess it's too late for a Christmas gift now because it is the uh, 24th of December. But you know stuff around to keep with you. Uh, these things are amazing, and I just I wanted to make another video and shout out about this. Uh, not only because the company. You know, company's been good to me. They've sent me a couple of products. Uh, some have been good. This has been incredible and amazing. And that's, again, why I wanted to do a second video, or I guess really a third video. I think I've done two with this. Uh, these are great. Definitely, if you're looking at a little chainsaw just to keep with you, uh, these are well worth the money. Probably well worth the money at if they were double the price, to be honest. So... Anyway, that is, uh, that is my thoughts on this after having it for, I don't know, close to a year now. This, this is not only held up, but uh, it's outperformed what I thought it would do. So, anyway, it's Matt from McGee Farms. Have a great day. If you like the videos, please consider subscribing to the channel, giving us a thumbs up. It's appreciated. Sharing it with your friends. All of it's appreciated and it helps the channel grow. Till next time, have a great day.